News at 11. Thanks for choosing 23 ABC News at 11. I'm Jackie Parks. And I'm Tim Callahan. A new study shows teens with loved ones in the military appear to be more at risk for suicide. In a study conducted at USC, researchers found a link between a family member's deployment history and a variety of mental health problems, including thoughts about suicide. The likelihood was greater for teens whose relatives were deployed overseas multiple times. And more than 1,900 students with parents or siblings in the military were included in that study. That's where we find 23 ABC's Carlos Correa live at the Bakersfield Vet Center with the latest on this research. Carlos, good evening. Good evening. The military has a wide variety of readiness programs for families left behind, but service leaders say not a lot of people know they exist. Eight years after his death, Crystal Villatoro is still coping with the loss of her older brother, Ramon, who died during his first deployment in Afghanistan. It hurts me a lot to talk about it before. I, was, I think it was just I was too young to really fully comprehend what had happened to us. Um, but um, yeah, I do remember that day. Villatoro has another brother and many cousins currently serving in the U.S. military. She can relate to other young people left behind by loved ones who are deployed. You're at a constant worry. You're always thinking if they're okay, if they're alive, if they've eaten, if they've gotten a shower. And it's just a constant worry. They're always in the back of your mind. According to a study conducted by USC, researchers found a link between a family member's deployment history and a variety of mental health problems, including thoughts of suicide. It's hard hard sometimes because families, they're used to being cohesive, but it, uh, but it comes with the understanding when you're in the military that uh, your loved one is, uh, I mean, that's their job, is they're going to get deployed. Although technology and social media has made it easier for military families to connect, support groups and programs are available to help families emotionally deal with a loved one's deployment. It's upsetting, and that's why it's important for uh, to talk to kids, to explain to them what mom or dad are doing. Um, whether it's mom that's getting deployed or dad's getting deployed, to make them help them understand that they're doing something for their country, to do something to protect them, to keep them safe from people that would wish us harm. And it's important that the kids get to talk about their feelings. Although many support programs are found on military bases, there are families of servicemen and women here in Kern County that rely on each other for the added support. Live at 11, Carlos Correa, 23BC. All right, Carlos.